How's it going everybody? It's Lucas Elliott here and thank you for tuning in to another video. I want to start by showing you a really f weird video. <laughs> it's like 10 seconds long, you might have actually seen it already. It's 10 seconds long, it's a girl with a hundred layers of makeup on her face and she's literally just recording herself kissing and you know what, just freaking look at this, it's, it's so f***ed up, seriously. So she's sat there for probably a pretty long time, I would think, applied a hundred layers of makeup and then has just uploaded a 10 second clip and it's now on the popular trending of YouTube. Me on the other hand, I can upload 10 videos. I spend about an hour editing each one or more than that and I get 20 views. In other news, it's finally freaking happened. Pokemon Go has been sued for not 1 million, not 2 million, but 5 million dollars. Apparently when they developed the app they thought people wouldn't be bothered that their houses were literally been turned into Pokestops and gyms. Basically there's a story of one guy and I'm sure there's loads of others like it but basically like four or five people turned up at his front door and they literally just asked if they could go into his back garden. Like, if that was me, like, I would be so pissed and I would just, you know what I'd do? I'd just go and sue Pokemon Go for five million dollars. And that is exactly what this guy has done, funnily enough. Actually, I'm not sure whether it's just this guy alone. I think it's loads of people collectively together have, like, grouped together to sue for five million dollars. Other stories include, remember that the uh, US Holocaust Museum, that, that's, a, that's a gym, right? If you didn't know that, then how up is that. People have literally just been going to this museum so they can get like a Snorlax or some shit. Basically, the human race is doomed, people are going insane and get ready for the freaking walking dead in real life. That's what I think. Literally like, I am so freaking done with Pokemon Go. I'm sorry, am I the only one who, no, what? Yeah, I probably am the only one to be fair. Seriously, I'm so done with it. To be fair, I think that's partly to do with the fact that I literally live in the middle of nowhere. I think the developers just chose like, yeah, uh, guys, guys, uh, just re remember, don't put any Pokemon near Lucas's house because that'll really annoy him, okay? There's literally, there's not even any Pidgeys near my house. I, like you guys are talking about Pidgeys, like they're f***ing annoying and no, I can't find f all. And that's basically why I hate the app so much. Anyway, I'm gonna end the video there, guys. I'm sorry it was a short one, just like a little rant that I thought I'd do. Hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, make sure to leave a like down below and hit that subscribe button. And again, thank you for watching my previous video because like seriously, I did put quite a lot of effort into editing that and even filming it, like it was so hard to film. It was awful. So thank you for watching that and thank you for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.